cookie loves and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. If you're new, I would love for you to quickly hit that subscribe button. If you like all things Halloween and autumn and comfy and cozy, I think you're going to really like this channel. I post every Monday and Thursday. Today's video is another Halloween hunting video. So it's been about a week since I checked Marshall's and the last time I was there, I think I got to share like literally a 30 second clip with you guys and that was it. That's all they had. So today I'm going to cross my fingers, cross yours as well, that Marshalls has gotten their lives together and that we find like a lot of Halloween at Marshalls. I'm also going to hit Home Goods because I know they're putting things out like hourly and I want to see what else they have. And then I'm going to run into Bath and Body Works. I don't know if I'm going to film in there yet. It may be busy and I'm literally going in there because today their pocket backs are a dollar in store only and you know that's a great deal I want to go grab like 10 of them so I'll share which ones I got but we'll see if I fill them in there depending on how busy it is I do live in a resort area and it's crazy from Friday through Sunday because everyone's coming down to the beach so it's already like busy up there I'm sure so we will see but I'm definitely going to share Marshall's and home goods so cross your fingers because I am like in the mood. I'm going to put some Halloween music on. It is super gloomy today. We're getting storms this afternoon, so we'll see. All right, let's go.
we are back home and I thought I would share a little bit of what I got. I did really good or I feel like I did good. I'm trying to be more like specific. I stood there in the line and like debated, not in line, in the aisle and debated like five things for like five minutes. But I put most of it back because like I said, I'm just trying. I, I want to get out what I have already, which is... I think I narrowed like 10 bins down to eight when we moved. I got rid of a bunch of just like kind of junkier things, you know, that I was like, okay, I'm not going to need that. So anyways, I want to see what I have. Those Decorate With Me videos are coming very soon, so please make sure you're subscribed. But we obviously had a massive code orange at Home Goods. No, Marshall's. Also stopped to get that coffee I keep talking about. Anyways, they had full Halloween aisles and aisles. They were still putting some stuff out, like in the food area. You know how, like, Marshalls and Home Goods has that little area of, like, foods where you'd find, like, the coffee syrups and stuff. So some of that is still missing, but so much decor, as you saw. So I didn't go to Home Goods because I'm trying to be good, and I had just gone there a few days ago. So I figured next week I'll record Home Goods for you guys. But there was enough at Marshall's to keep me happy. So here are the three things I got from Marshall's. And then I did pop into Bath and Body Works, but I didn't record anything. The only new thing that was there was the Spooky Lane, Spooky Cider Lane 3 Wick that has, like, the skull lid, which my girl Sierra texted me a picture of the other day. It's, like, $32, though, because of the lid. And I don't think they make a regular one. Like, I think the only way to get a 3 Wick in Spooky Cider Lane is to get that pretty lid. And it's gorgeous, but I'm not paying $32 for a candle. So, I just grabbed some sanitizers, but I'll share which ones first, actually. Then we'll jump into the Marshalls things. I have to say, I already talked in a previous video about how sweet some of the people at my Bath & Body Works are. And there was another girl in there today. I wasn't even recording, but she was one of the people I talked to last time, so she remembered me. It is so freaking nice when you do what I do, and people are like... I don't know, just sweet and open to it. Like, I have my Halloween Town shirt on. That's how the conversation started. She's like, oh, my God, now I have to go home and watch. It's been too long. I love that you love Halloween so much, and we just got to chatting about what I do. And I don't know, it's, like, kind of nerve-wracking. I don't care how long you've done this for. When you bring out your camera in a store, especially, like, if you can see the lens I have now, it's, like, this big. Sierra and I talked about this, too. You feel like you're, like, paparazzi. People who are just in there shopping are always looking at you. Always. Like, you'd think in 2022 they would know what's going on, and they may, but they still look. So, anyways, when you have employees, like, at that Home Goods near me and this Bath & Body Works that are like, Oh, my God, girl, go ahead. That is so cool. Just film. Do what you need to do. You feel, like, so much better. So, Anyways, she was so sweet. Okay, here's what I got from Bath & Body Works first. Okay, so I got mostly like a lot of doubles. I'll just show one of each. Like I got three flannels. You don't want to see all three. But yes, anyways, the first one is flannel. I'm really excited for this one. I love this candle. Oh my God, yeah. I haven't smelled most of these. I just, oh my, oh my God. It smells just like the candle. The reason I love Bath & Body Works pocket back so much because they're like a perfume it's like an added burst of perfume I got this one for Glenn mahogany teakwood one of my favorite candles definitely more masculine scent sorry you guys I have like just so much paint crap on my nails anyways um I love this scent I thought he could throw it in his truck and then I got a few sweater weathers I mean such a staple you guys know how much I love the scent. You cannot ever, ever, ever go wrong with sweater weather. I grabbed two afternoon apple picking. I haven't smelled this yet. I couldn't find the, what's it called? Uh, what's it called? The other apple one that I love. Oh my God, I can't think of it right now. That one apple one that is so, apple pumpkin. Pumpkin apple. Pumpkin apple. They didn't have that one. I was disappointed because that's one of my favorites. I got two more of the Treat Yourself, the Marshmallow Pumpkin Lattes. I have a few of these, and if we could focus here. There we go. And I love this scent. It is delicious. And then I grabbed a few leaves. I'm going to give my mom some of these as well. But I think that's it. Just a few of each. We got a whole fun bag of them here. And now to move on to Marshalls. Under the first thing that I snagged, I was really excited to see. I have seen these all over the internet. And of course, this was the first time my Marshalls had Halloween, period. But this is the two pack of Ghost. They are $24.99, but it's a really good deal because a lot of times one pillow runs like $20. Okay, we're shedding a little. We're shedding a little. Um, but this is a two-pack. So you've got this one that's, like, supposed to be the boy-looking one or whatever. And then this one who's, like, the girl because she has little cute eyelashes. So I love the set. It's actually a really good deal for two. I mean, they're big, as you can see. 
They're good size pillows. My thought was Salem has a little wicker chair. I'm going to be decorating both the kids' rooms for Halloween. You'll see that in my Halloween decorating series. This girl one can sit in her room on the wicker chair, and then the boys can use this one in their room. I'm actually really excited to kind of go all out. Wyatt asked me this morning, like, about a few different things he wanted to do in the room, and I want to take that into consideration because it's their space. So I have some things in mind, but then I'm going to also let them kind of, like, gear me in the direction they want to go, if that makes sense. And then the next thing is for Salem Girls Room. I think I've mentioned on this channel that I am doing a mermaid theme for her. That is what she requested. I am so sweaty. I have the car off because it gets loud. Oh my god. Okay. It wouldn't be like a pumpkin and gray video if I didn't complain about the heat or tell you that I'm sweaty. Anyways, because she's doing mermaids, it's very like mauve and lots of wicker and you know, I do like boho in my house. So when I saw these, I was like, okay, perfect for her room. This is the little three pack. I'm not gonna open it. This one's turned around. If you saw my like Marshalls, I think it was haul where I shopped online like a month ago before the stores had anything out, I got these little guys in orange and a few of you have been so sweet to tell me that they have them in black i saw the black ones in store but i decided to get these little pink ones for her instead she's going to have this big white shelf and it's going to have mermaid things and so i just thought i'd incorp incorporate like a little girly halloween for her because she's three so these all light up i love these sets they're 7.99 for three of them and they are ceramic and they light up like if you see these get them trust me i shared the orange ones i'm obsessed i'll probably get black eventually but like these are going to be so cute. She's going to flip out. This is such a fun age for her because she's literally going to flip out about everything this year. Okay, and the last thing I found at Marshall's I was the most excited for. These are not new, and I wanted the bigger one last year. Let me take the tag off because it's hard to see it in all of its cute glory. I wanted the bigger one last year, and I couldn't get my hands on it, and I still have never seen the larger one, which sucks, but... I've never also seen the small one in person, so I was very happy to at least see the little one. But this is that little ceramic ghost that is, like, super popular. And you're not going to be able to see right now the difference. Yeah, you can't tell that. But he is lighting up. It is super cute. These are actually cuter in person than I even thought. I love them. I wanted to. They only had one out, but these are only $9.99, I think. Yeah, $9.99. So you can't beat that for a nice ceramic ghost that lights up. It'll look so cute in the kitchen, glowing at night. I will be going back to Marshall's probably by Sunday to see if they put more out. My thought is people were so busy, I didn't want to stop them and ask if they had more in the back. But I'm hoping that they put out the larger size because it's really cute and you have a big one and then the baby. So I'm going to go back probably in another day or two and see if they have more. My thought is I took one, maybe they'll put another one out. But like seriously so happy I got my hands on one of them. I've been wanting it for a long time. Perfect timing with the new kitchen coming. All right, my spooky loves, that is going to wrap up today's Halloween hunting video. I hope you enjoyed. I'm sorry I didn't end up doing home goods too, but we're going to go there soon. You know I do one of these every week, at least one Halloween hunting. And I'm also trying to be really mindful of what I'm spending. So in my head, I was like, skip home goods. You found really good wins at Marshall's. But I like that stuff a lot. So anyways, let me know if you saw anything in the stores that you want to get your hands on or if your Marshalls already has Halloween out and what your favorite item was from the haul. Don't forget to subscribe before you go, please. We are already over 4K, and I'm so freaking grateful for you guys. I upload every Monday and Thursday. Hit that notification bell, too. You'll just get an email, like a reminder every time I post. And I love you guys. I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye.